Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to make people laugh easily. This will be a very simplistic tutorial for being funny and just making yourself a little bit funnier. Now, some people are already funny and others struggle to be funny, okay? I have generally never had trouble being funny. I'm not saying I'm the funniest person on the earth, but people generally tend to laugh when they're around me to some uh, to some degree of, of funniness, okay? So anyways, these are six little tips that I came up with that will help you be a little bit funnier, okay? Make people laugh. Number one, and this sounds corny, but it works, tell a joke. So literally go look up a whole bunch of jokes, memorize them for the most part, and look for opportunities to see those jokes. If you see a joke about a tree, then you're going to, you know, then you're going to look around for a tree and then boom, you can insert that joke in conversation when you see the tree. So just the more jokes that you know, the more you can say and the more you can sort of alter those jokes to be, uh, to fit that certain specific situation. Okay. Uh, that's number one, tell a joke. It's corny, but trust me, it works. Number two, make fun of yourself a little bit. Not a lot. You don't want to like put yourself down, but don't be afraid to make fun of yourself. Like I will tell you right now, honestly, this is the honest truth. Okay. I went home. Okay. I went, you know, I had a long day at work. It was hot. I was in the car filming a lot. I did a whole bunch of videos on my lunch hour before work, after work and so forth. And I went home and I have four young kids and my youngest two are twins. Um, so I have Luke, who's uh, almost six years old in a couple weeks. He'll be six at the time of me filming this. Cause when I release this, it'll be much later, but the time of me filming this, he's almost six actually. Yeah. And, uh, you know, his birthday is this Saturday. So he'll be six in, uh, whatever it is, like five days or something like that. We already have his party planned. Okay. We have Olivia who just turned four four recently and then we have the twins who are about uh, uh 21 months almost okay so i got home and i'm smelling like a little little stink and i'm like i'm thinking like okay you know the, the babies wear diapers i'm like maybe someone did a little something you know maybe someone did a little surprise if you know what i'm saying a little number two right and i changed it i'm like and i changed them and the smell is still there and I'm, i couldn't figure it out my wife says mike like she asked me, I'm going to tell you that she asked me, did you fart? I said, no, I didn't fart. I swear I didn't fart. We later discovered my socks smelled like absolute sewage. Okay. I'm not excited. I wish I, I'm, and I still have them on in the car right now. This, it reeks. I smell them. I took, look, like, you don't believe me. I took off my shoes. Look, because they're, they already smell so much. I got to let them air out. Okay. I, I'm being serious. I didn't do that for the video. I honestly took them off. So poke fun at yourself a little bit. People will laugh. I, you might be laughing at what I said. I hope you are, but honest, that's the truth. I swear. That's the truth. True story. Okay. Anyways, a uh, number three is to uh, tell a funny story. Okay. You want to, you know, if something happens in your life, that's funny. You want to remember it. And then you can tell that story. I do this all the time. I always tell stories um, that are funny. Like I just did. And, um, you know, they can be about yourself, but if you're telling a funny story, it can be about anyone else as well. So tell a funny story, something that sticks out in your memory, something that caused you to laugh will probably cause someone else to laugh as well. Number four, I got so I wrote all my notes down and it's a little bit messy. So just bear with me. Uh, okay, here we go. So number four is to look around for stuff that's funny. Okay. So just beside me over here, I'm not going to, I was going to pan the camera, but it's okay. There's a tree and the tree goes up, but then there's branches that look like this. And literally if I had to make a joke about the tree, the first thing that I thought of was literally, it looks like it's doing the YMCA, the Y of the YMCA. It looks like the dance. Okay. Um, yeah. So, you know, like just look around, you can find something funny when you look around for sure. Okay. Number five, oh, over exaggerate if you over exaggerate something it just makes it a lot funnier so if you're talking about you know like uh i'm just trying to think off the top of my head um you're talking about uh you know you're you're going for a run and your feet really hurt if you over exaggerate said i was going for a run and it felt like a little raccoon was just nipping at my feet like they hurt so much oh uh, and i looked down expecting to see a raccoon there's nobody there right you know like or for instance the other night i stubbed my toe so literally i would you know if i was over exaggerating i'd say i was walking in the dark you know i had to go use the bathroom and i boom i stubbed my toe against the dresser and i didn't want to turn the light on because i know if i looked down i was gonna find a piece of my toe over there by the dresser and then i'm in the bathroom with the rest of my foot you know because some of it fell off there would be a trail of blood you know if you over exaggerate uh it becomes funnier okay and that's a true story i did stop my toe the other night and i didn't turn on the light because being serious i was like man i swear i lost my toe i didn't but you know when you stub your toe it really hurts right and i was like ah you know insert all those words that i can't say you know anyways um number six um keep a smile on your face people are gonna laugh more if you smile you can obviously tell dry humor 
My wife is very sarcastic. She smiles a lot, but when she talks humor, she's a very sarcastic person. So her funniness is in sarcasm with a straight face. But my funniness is the opposite. I'm laughing, smiling, joking. That's so you know, keep a smile on. People will be a little bit lighter hearted and they'll be easier to laugh, to get to laugh if you keep a smile on your face. And that's it. That is how to make people laugh easily. A tutorial for being a little bit funnier than you currently are. Um, just whether you are already funny or not at all, just a tutorial for being a little bit funnier. If you like this video tutorial, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. <laughs> Laugh it up, baby. Um, let me know your tips for um, being uh, funnier as a comment down below. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Like that, eh? Like the pipe show, baby. Welcome. Which way is the, which way is the beach? That way, baby, right over there. Oof, I think I just pulled a muscle. I'm being serious. I haven't worked out in a long time. So anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Be sure to give it a like. Um, comment down below. Subscribe. And that's basically it. Um, and that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.